Russia has recently conducted a launch of an intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM, as part of its routine nuclear drills. This exercise is a demonstration of the country's strategic nuclear capabilities and is intended to ensure the readiness and reliability of its nuclear forces. Such drills typically involve the testing of various components of Russia's nuclear triad, which includes land-based ICBMs, submarine-launched ballistic missiles, and strategic bombers. The specific missile launched in this exercise has not been detailed, but Russia's arsenal includes the RS-24 Yars, RS-12M Topol, and the new RS-28 Sarmat, among others. These drills come amid heightened tensions in the international arena and are closely watched by other global powers. The purpose of these exercises, according to Russian officials, is to validate the performance of the nation's nuclear weapon systems and ensure that they function as intended in a real-world scenario. While these drills are a standard part of Russia's military operations, they often draw significant attention and concern from other countries, particularly those within NATO, due to the potential implications for global security and stability. These drills come amid heightened tensions in the international arena and are closely watched by other global powers. The purpose of these exercises, according to Russian officials, is to validate the performance of the nation's North Korea has recently test-fired its most advanced intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM, demonstrating a significant leap in its missile capabilities. This test indicates that the missile potentially has the range to reach the mainland United States, marking a considerable advancement in North Korea's strategic military power. The missile, believed to be the Wasong-17, represents North Korea's latest technology in its ongoing efforts to develop long-range nuclear delivery